discussing about the public address system. What is this public address system? We are addressing some gathering, the gathering a huge people. Publicly we are addressing, that's why this system helps us to address the gathering. The voice of human cannot go the far distance because the signal, the sound signal is a longitudinal wave. So longitudinal waves can travel only up to some distance in the air. So we are using this instrument, this is called as amplifier. So whenever this instrument is called as microphone. Whenever I am speaking something in the gathering, here the microphone converts the, mecha, the sound signal into electrical signal. This microphone converts the sound signal into electrical signal. The equivalent electrical signal, whenever uh, there is a diaphragm inside this microphone, whenever I change the variations or when, whenever the vibrations in the sound is changing, Accordingly, equivalently, the diaphragm vibrates. Based on the vibrations of the diaphragm, equivalent electrical signal is passed to this wire. This cable is called as aux cable. Now we will connect this aux cable to this amplifier. This amplifier amplifies the electrical signal. Remember, this amplifier cannot have the ability to amplify the sound signal. This can only amplify the electrical signal. So this microphone converts the sound to electrical signal. This amplifier amplifies the electrical signal. Now the amplified output is given to this speaker. This speaker delivers the output. We have eight, two 8 ohms speakers. And the power rating RMS is 100 watts and peak is 200 watts. Okay? Right, now we will see the front panel of this amplifier. Before that, you can observe here, there is a fuse, AC fuse, 5 amperes. Whenever a current flows greater than the 5 amperes, then the fuse breaks. By pro so it protects the amplifier circuit. Different remaining ports are there, auxiliary cable on port is there. FM port is there, we can connect directly a single lead wire, the FM signal will be received if the signal is, if the signal strength is good. Okay, we will see the front panel. Now I have connected this mic to the mic 1 terminal of the amplifier. Now my voice signal is amplified, but output is observed at this speaker only. Even though it is amplifying, the output voice signal or the output sound signal is delivered by this speaker. Now this speaker is connected to, 8 ohms of this speaker is connected to 8 ohms terminal of this amplifier and the COM of this speaker is connected to COM terminal of this amplifier. Now you can observe here, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. In this amplifier, we have the provision to connect at a time 5 mics. I can vary the amplitude. You can observe my voice amplitude is increasing. Here, the master volume. You can observe the two buttons. All these variable knobs are nothing but variable resistors. The variable resistors may be carbon or wire wall. But in amplifiers we use carbon. So in the amplifier we are using all the knobs are carbon potentiometers. All these variable knobs are potentiometers. In the first chapter we have already learned. Now when I am wearing the bass, you can observe. The low frequencies will be amplified. Hello, hello. This is, I am increasing the bass. I am gradually increasing the bass. Now you are unable to hear my voice. See, now I am decreasing. When the bass is high, you are unable to hear my voice. Why? Because the bass is amplifying the low frequencies below the 3 kHz. Normally, the male voice frequency range is 3 kHz. Female voice frequency range is 5 kHz. 
the small kids either girl or boy the voice frequency range is around 9 kilohertz their voice frequency beyond 9 kilohertz human vocal cord cannot produce the sound so the frequencies above the 9 kilohertz they are called as treble below the 3 kilohertz range we, we will call them as bass or bass so here those frequencies can be amplified by using the knob bass so the treble frequencies can be amplified by using the treble so whenever you see the effects of the dj in the functions whenever some theater effects comes that is possible only when they know how to operate the bass at this bass if they do not properly utilize this if they operate this terminal at zero then no effects will come even though the instrument has the ability so whenever you play a song this bass should be kept in medium or high but whenever a person is speaking this should be kept at zero or minimum when the bass terminal can be kept at high only when you are playing a song for the effects purpose when a person is speaking this should be kept at low now i am increasing the treble hello 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 now i am increasing the treble high frequencies are being amplified see this is the treble at high range you are observing an echo with my voice okay now i am decreasing okay so now the treble is at zero if i am increasing the master this is only amplifying the voice okay so this is how we use the master bass or bass here treble okay now i am operating the second mic hello 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 now i am operating the third mic hello 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 now i am operating the fourth mic hello hello now fifth mic in the fifth mic we have the switch mic to aux now i am changing the switch to the mic and we are operating this is how we connect the public address system now you can connect this public address system at your homes during the functions also you can connect on your own okay all right so while connecting we have to make sure one thing that when you are connecting a single speaker you have to connect the 8 ohms and come to the 8 ohms and come when you are connecting two speakers these two speakers can be connected either in parallel or in series when they are connected in parallel output will be low when they are connected in series output will be we have two speakers eight ohm speakers and amplifier when we want to connect a single speaker then we have to connect to the com to the com and eight ohms to the eight ohm but now we are connecting the two speakers at a time the two speakers can be connected either in series or in parallel now first we are connecting in pair when we want to connect the two speakers in parallel the resistance of two speakers becomes 4 ohms so 8 should be connected to 4 and com should be connected to com now 8 is connected to 4 and com is connected to com this is how when we connect the two speakers in pair when we are connecting the two speakers in series then this com terminal should be connected to 8 ohm these two terminals should be shorted 8 is connected to 16 and com is connected to com now these two speakers are connected in series configuration this will give the maximum output now we are discussing how to connect to two speakers two loud speakers at a time in a parallel connection here in this loud speaker which is 8 ohm impedance we are taking the positive here in this loud speaker also we are taking the positive we are connecting these two positives to the 4 ohms of the amplifier and we are taking the com of this speaker and com of the second speaker we are connecting the both coms to the com of the amplifier because we are connecting two speakers parallelly the parallel resistance or the parallel impedance is 4 ohms that's why we are connecting the both positives of these speakers to the 4 ohms 
In reality, uh, the resistance does not have any positive or negatives. But because they are mentioning 8 ohms and calm, we are saying the positive is 8 ohms and the calm is almost like ground. We are connecting the calm to the calm and 8 ohms to the 4 ohms. Now these two speakers are connected in parallel to the amplifier. Okay, now we will see the front panel connection. One point you have to be very careful. These two speakers are 8 ohm speakers. We should not connect these two 8 ohms to the 8 ohms of this amplifier at a time. Because these two 8 ohms when they are connecting parallelly, the equivalent resistance is 4 ohms. We have to connect 8 ohms to 8 ohm speakers parallelly to the 4 ohms terminal of the amplifier and the calm terminal of the amplifier. Now we will see the front panel. Now you can observe this is the output of two speakers when they are connected in parallel to the 4 ohms terminal of the amplifier. Now the output which we got previously is far bigger than the output of this because at that time we have connected only one 8 ohm speaker. Now we are connecting two 8 ohm speakers in parallel. We are connecting two 8 ohm speakers in parallel. So equivalent resistance is 4 ohms. Equivalent resistance is 4 ohms. Now I am increasing the mic volume. I am also increasing the master volume. I am increasing the bass. Hello, 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 hello. You can observe the changes. Hello, 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 hello. This is the bass at higher level. Now I am decreasing. Hello, 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 decreasing. Hello, 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 hello. Okay? Now, you can wear, I am wearing the treble. Hello, 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 hello. Okay, now I am decreasing. Hello, 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 hello. Now, boss is at lower level and treble is at lower level. Okay? This is how we connect the two speakers in parallel to the amplifier. Now we will observe the series connection. This configuration. See here. The calm of this wire is shorted with the 8 ohms. And now the 8 ohms of this wire is connected to the 16 ohms. And the calm of this wire is connected to here. Now we will see the front panel. Hello, 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 hello. This is the 16 ohm output. This output is higher compared to the single 8 ohm speaker and when the two speakers are connected in parallel. Okay? Now again we are checking when we are increasing the bus, the low frequencies are being amplified. Hello, 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 hello. Now when the treble is increased, high frequencies are amplified. Hello, 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 hello. So for the better voice, we have to keep the bass or bass at low and the treble at the low. So this is how we connect the two amplifiers in series.